Well, how's it going out there, folks? Rooster in Tennessee, roostercb.com. And just a new product announcement or new to roostercb.com is going to be these uh, Taurus 25 amp power supplies. And they're pretty cool. Don't take up a lot of space on your desk. I have multiple uh, different terminals that you can hook up on them, including the cigarette lighter style plug, USB ports, uh, your uh, terminals over here to the right, and these do unscrew all the way. Uh, you can take them off, and then you've got your uh, small uh, terminals over here. So uh, multiple different hookups on the power supply. It is variable voltage. Uh, the power cord plugs into the back, so you can detach the power cord forward if you need to uh, transport it anywhere. It has the handy little handle on top of it, and it doesn't weigh very much. Pretty, uh, pretty lightweight. So uh, power switch is back here in the back. And it has the uh, voltmeter and amp meter on it. And they rate these uh, around 15 volts, give or take. So we've just got it plugged into a, a little surge protector down here now. Uh, I did put a multimeter on it, and that voltmeter is pretty accurate. It's 14.75 volts on these terminals over here. So uh, voltmeter is pretty accurate. Again, you might get one that's 14.8 volts, one that's 14.9. If we plugged it directly into the wall, it may even be 15 volts. Uh, but right there in that ballpark. Um, and unless you're running like a 2879C, you're not going to want to go over 15 volts anyway. But these are pretty cool. You guys can see the voltage real smooth, how the variable voltage turns up and down. It does have a fan built into it. Of course, when you turn the voltage down, it's going to, turn the voltage supply down to the fan. So the fan slows down when you turn it down to uh, to nine volts or whatever. Uh, but again, that's pretty handy to have that variable voltage on there. And a nice quiet run supply doesn't take up a lot of room on the desk. And I may end up keeping one of these for myself. Uh, we'll get these listed up on the website and uh, see how they do. I may, uh, I guess we could probably hook a radio up to it and kind of see how they function with the radio before we wrap our video up here. What I'll do, I've got a stock Anytone Quad 6 Pro and uh, I will actually hook it up to it and we'll kind of test it out and see how it goes. So give me a second here and we will uh, move a few things around, pause the video and we'll be right back. So uh, rather than just looking at the outside of it, we'll actually do a function test on it too. All right, we'll be right back. All right, guys, so we're back, and I've got just a converted uh, Anytone Quad 6 Pro over here. Has not had any mods, any upgrades, or anything like that done to it. Uh, hopefully, we'll get a video uh, done on one of those here pretty soon just to show you what they do. It's a stock radio, uh, but that's what we've got going on. We've just got it hooked up to the little terminals over here, and 14.7, uh, 14.6 volts. We'll just see uh, how it handles the Anytone. Go ahead and put our meter on peak. Back here in the back, 100 watt scale, 100 watt slug. So we'll be looking at the bottom and uh, just see what we got going on here. All righty, check, 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 audio, audio, check, 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 audio, check, 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 audio, check, check, check. So seems to be holding it pretty well, 100 watts or so, uh, PEP there. And uh, it's, it's acting just fine. Drops down 0.1 volts. Again, it may not drop down at all if we had it plugged up directly into the wall there. But as you guys can see, uh, it's holding the uh, holding the Anytone just great, not having any kind of trouble whatsoever uh, toting the load with it. And just out of curiosity, what the Anytone is doing average. Hello, hello, 25 swinging 30 watts, uh, average power on AM there. So that's the Taurus uh, power supply guys. We'll get these uh, listed up on the website. Let me know what you think about it. Handy little power supply. Again, it's just 25 amps, but uh, great to run like your striker radios, any tone radios. Uh, little RM Italy 203Ps would run good on these. Um, you know, just a lot of different stuff that doesn't draw a lot of current. Some of your, some of your little two pills that you might run just on AM only, uh, you could probably even get by running one. Uh, but that's it. Taurus, uh, C-O-R, Core 25 uh, regulated uh, switch and power supply. All right, guys, thanks. Rooster in 10, roostercb.com. See you, bye.